Hey guys, Dan the Wolfman, KetJiu.com, showing you some uh, uh, Karate Go Jiu Jitsu punch defense. It's not that it's always realistic, but it can be. You can find it in the chaos in a fight, in a street fight, if you drill this kind of stuff. In MMA, it has happened. I'm going to show a standing arm triangle defense to a right cross and possibly to a spinning back fist. Uh, I showed the spinning back fist to Korean Zombies fighters in Seoul a couple years ago. Um, Matt Riddle's done in the UFC against the spinning back fist against the cage. It has happened. Chris Lytle slipped across. Did it in Pancrase. Luis Alvarito did it in shoot boxing. Um, Marina Schaefer's done a duck under to it, basically going to the back in uh, amateur MMA. Um, Marlon Sandor's done it twice in Dream. So you can get their arm, standing arm triangle many times if you drill. Slowly, as this man goes right across at me, most important is I step off at this 45 degrees. Go. As long as I'm moving around, I'm free to move. That's the most important part of martial arts, is learning go. Whatever cool thing I did is drafting to this dark side, to the back side. Jiu-Jitsu says that, get to his back, right? We want to do that. So, next is I'm going to slip and parry and also shoot this at the same time. Go ahead, boom. Okay. Go ahead, boom. Next, boom. Come head to head, Gable grip. This is going into his artery already. From there, I'm gonna off balance him, load his weight, kick that leg out, drop my head here, like an alligator, jacarista. This one goes up, this vector goes across, his shoulder into his neck, and my own shoulder, third vector, goes down, down into his throat. So up, across with the power source of legs, and shoulder down with gravity. Three force vectors that Chris Weidman recently did. Okay, again, boom, shoot. Come to the other side. Again, shoot. Go on this side. Actually, this angle is best. Sorry. Shoot. 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 Boom. Okay. Then here, tight. I can choke him up, control him here if I wanted to. Or off the hills, kill him, and finish. If that happened, I'd feel very lucky. This turn. Yep. You okay? Oh. All right. Big slide right there. Oh. I was just relaxed, stance. Boom, do this. Ready? Go. Go. Okay. Now, you guys see I didn't really go soda him that time. I walked through him, it's just where I felt his mount. So I actually walked through him. That's fine. Um, same thing can happen. He doesn't really know how to throw a spinning back fist. I just showed him for the video. But against a spinning back fist, I can do the same thing. <coughs> Slowly. If you knew you were fighting Alexander Smenko, you want to drill this one. Because at the very least, if you don't do something fancy, you're learning to draft and cover at the least, and left hook back or whatever at that 45 angle against a spinning back fist. Slowly. So I don't want to stand here. Go. At the very least, I do something like this, and at least I moved off the power back. Okay, take that big step in. Boom. Direction. Okay. Same thing. Okay. Here. Down here. Down and off down. Stand up strong. Down and off down. Then I reach the leg out. Slowly. Oh. Now, quickly. Don't fall until I make you fall. That balance. Come to this side. 
For the turn. Could be a spinning back kick, could be a spinning hook kick. There's a spin when he takes that cheat step. Okay, a little bit ugly, guys. I apologize. You're going to say it's me, it's not totally me. It's he's new to striking. But that could be on the street. It could be bastardized like that. I might be off, I might drive him. Anyway, it's a good way to practice arm triangles. Hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe. Thank you.